Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How to send GRE scores to universities. So, you've successfully completed the GRE, and now it's time to send your scores to universities. But how do you do that? Don't worry, we've got you covered. Follow these simple steps to ensure your scores are sent to the right institutions. Step 1. Know your recipients. Before you start, make a list of the universities and their specific programs you want to send your scores to. Remember, you can send your scores to as many universities as you like, but each additional recipient comes with a fee. Step 2. Access your ETS account log. Into your ETS account, the same one you use to register for the GRE. If you don't have one, you'll need to create one at the ETS website. Step 3. Select Send Additional Score Reports once logged in, go to the GRE section and click on Send Additional Score Reports. This will allow you to send your scores to institutions that were not included in your original four free recipients. Step 4. Choose your recipients. Search for the universities and their specific programs using the search function. Once you've found the correct program, add it to your list of recipients. Step 5. Review and pay. Review your list of recipients and make sure everything is correct. Once you're satisfied, proceed to the payment page. The fee for sending additional score reports is $1.27 per recipient. Step 6. Confirm and submit. After payment, you'll receive a confirmation email from ETS, and your scores will be sent electronically to your chosen universities within five, seven business days. And there you have it. By following these steps, you'll ensure your GRE scores are sent to the right universities, helping you take one step closer to your academic goals. Good luck! To learn more, check out these links which you can click in the description below, and feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe, and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.